Hi, my name is Chase Norwood, and I'll be explaining the chemistry of film photography. The composition of the camera. Most cameras have metal, plastic, wood, and glass. The composition of the film. The film has four layers. First layer is the protective coating. Protective coating protects the second layer that is the emulsion. The emulsion has gelatin and silver halide crystals in it. The silver halide crystals is what makes it light sensitive. The third layer is the film base. The film base is a polymer that is chemically stable and flexible. The fourth layer is the anti halation backing. This keeps the light from reflecting off the back of the film. When the film is fully developed, it is brought into the dark rooms, and this is where the photos are produced. They are produced by projecting the film onto a large sheet of light sensitive paper. The sheet is burned by the light and then put through a series of chemicals to fully develop. Developing the film and developing the photos are very similar processes. Each process has to go through three different chemicals. The first chemical is called the developer, which reacts with the silver halide crystals to bring out the picture. The second chemical is the stop bath. The third chemical is called the fixer. These chemicals make it so that the silver halide crystals affected by the light are visible and the ones that aren't affected by the light are removed. This is a film camera. As you can see, the film is put into the back of here and pulled through right here directly behind the lens which opens for the light to shine through. And these are just a few of the photos that I have taken during my career for film photography. Thank you.